brand new Netflix show from producer and former First Lady Michelle Obama debuted last week, and it's something the entire family will love. Our girl Sheila Wako got a taste of what waffles and mochi is all about with a cooking lesson from Spice Finch's Jennifer Carroll. Check this out. Waffles and Mochi follows two best friends on a culinary adventure to learn about new flavors, cultures, and ingredients to use in the kitchen. Along the way, they'll meet new friends, including renowned chefs and celebrity guests. As First Lady, Michelle Obama supported educating children on healthy habits. As producer of Waffles and Mochi, she continues her work sparking children's interest in good food. When Michelle was in the White House, Jennifer Carroll, executive chef at Rittenhouse Square's Spice Finch and owner of Carroll Couture Cuisine, helped kick off her Let's Move campaign. Healthy food can be good and delicious too, right? We got to cook with her and kids and really like get going. So to now be doing a promo for her new show, it's like just all coming together. And just as waffles and mochi are curious in the kitchen, I'm always looking for healthy new recipes. So Jennifer taught me how to make blistered cherry tomatoes with pasta and basil. We're gonna let them sit wherever they fall so they start to sear and create that little blister. And we both have our little basil plant. Jennifer loves growing herbs like basil and even grows her own cherry tomatoes, a great activity to do with kids. It gives them the you know, the fun to see see it grow and to see where it comes from and to be a part of the entire process from growing it ground up into cooking it and then into actually enjoying it and eating it. She even taught me a trick to make our Parmesan look a little fancier. You can use just a regular old peeler and you can just take nice little strips and they make like little curls. This is something fun like the kids like can do, everyone can do this. My tomatoes are starting to look like a little, like melt it down. And I'm just swirling the pan to kind of incorporate those juices that are coming out. We moved our pasta and some pasta water to the pan, which meant we were almost done. Good news, since I was getting hungry. We're gonna go right into the bowl with the basil and the cheese. And I like to garnish with a little more cheese. Oh, who doesn't? Come on, Jen. <laughs> See how easy cooking is? Yes, it's easy and fun. And I couldn't let Jennifer go without asking for her advice to young women hoping to enter the culinary arts. Go with your gut a lot and stand up for yourself. Speak out and always do what you feel is right. There's so many women now that are banding together and have formed these communities. Join one of those groups. Join us at Let's Talk Philadelphia, let the women in food, check us out. And, um, we're there to help and support and mentor. For Philly Live, cheers. I'm Sheila Watko. Oh, my goodness, that looks so good. Sheila has to give me that recipe. Waffles and Mochi is streaming now on Netflix. If you want your own chance to cook with Jennifer, she teaches virtual cooking lessons through her company, Carol Couture Cuisine. Or if you'd rather skip the cooking altogether, just get right to the eating. I am Lithia Spice Finch. They just reopened last week for indoor and outdoor dining as well as takeout. So go ahead and visit Jennifer and the Spice Finch team for a taste of Mediterranean flavors on South 17th Street in Center City, Philadelphia.